Um, from his pool book, The Straight Pool Bible, by um, Arthur Babe Cranfield, he's got an interesting concept in here. Um, it's called the arrow for aiming. And he's got a little part on it. He's got the diagram, which I'll have a picture of, and how to use it. But basically what it is is an object ball is two and one-fourth inches wide, and um, if you cut it in half, it's one and one-eighth inches wide. So this arrow is actually two and one-fourth inches um, wide, and then if you put it down like this on the cue ball, then you're going to find that that's going to be um, your aim point. So here's your contact point, your aim point. So just put it down like that. And no matter where the cue ball is in relation to it, you just want the cue ball to land on that aim point to hit the contact point. So here's the arrow. It's really easy to make. It's got a little piece of paper. A lot like the ghost ball technique, but it actually gives you a specific point you're aiming for. So you're aiming right for the end of the arrow. So, say I have a shot like this, put it right there, put my uh, cue ball down. Now that's going to be my aim spot where the tip of the arrow is, and then that's going to be my contact spot. So. shot. So yeah, one and one eighth inches away is your aim spot. Just lay it down, put it at any angle. I'll do a more severe cut here. And I'm aiming the exact center of the cue ball into that aim spot. the arrow for aiming. So there's the aiming arrow. You just go straight into the corner pocket, put your uh, cue ball right there. So it's the point right there is one and a half, one and one eighth inches away from the contact spot. And place your cue ball right on the center and shoot it right in the pocket.